Hey everyone, this is my complete guide to getting realistic ray tracing set up in Minecraft 1.17.1. Apollo RT is a new ray tracing shader which recently came out which I will be combining with a realistic resource pack. I will show you how to install everything step by step from vanilla. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments section below, otherwise let's get straight to the tutorial. First, you will need to check if you have Java installed before you install Optifine. You can do this by going to Windows Search and searching About Java. If it doesn't appear, you will need to install it from the link I have left in the description. There are two versions of Java you can install, which is either 32-bit or 64-bit. You can check which one you need by searching About Your PC in Windows Search. Once Java is installed, you will then need to install Optifine by opening the link and going to Downloads. Select and download the latest version, which is 1.17.1 .1 for me, and open the file. If you can't open the file, try running Jarfix to fix the issue. I will leave a link for it in the description. Optifine should locate your game folder automatically. Just click install and close the window. Next, launch Minecraft to make sure Optifine is installed properly. You should see it in the drop down list. Now, to get Apollo RT installed, you will need to go to the Patreon link and download it. Once it's downloaded, drag and drop it to your desktop. If you're using a different browser, it will be in your downloads folder. Then, you will need to download the Rotoblox texture pack by opening the CurseForge link and downloading the latest version. Drag and drop it to your desktop as well. Now go back into the game, go to Options, Video Settings, Shaders and open the Shaders folder. Then just drag and drop the Apollo RT file into the folder. Open the game and click on the shaders to enable them. Go back, go to resource packs and open the resource pack folder. For this texture pack, you have to open the zip file and drag out the version you want. The top one is the base version for best performance. Then just drag and drop it to your resource pack folder and enable it in game by clicking the arrow. Now both the shader and texture pack should be installed. Head back into the game to check if it's installed. And that's it. If you found this useful, leave a like and a sub, otherwise thanks for watching.